My name is Emily. I'm an occupational therapy student at Tufts University and this semester I'm in an assistive, assistive technology course and um, one of our first projects was making something um, that would be useful to someone with a disability out of low tech. So um, basically recycled or scrap material. The materials I used were um, a long thin fabric strap which I sewed together and made the seams a bit nicer than it was because it was a bit jagged. Um, I used hot glue, I used glitter, which was not necessary, but it was necessary for me, and a dinosaur sticker. <laughs> Again, not necessary, but necessary for me. Um, so the idea behind this device is um, personal. I have Ehlers-Danlos Syndrome, which means my joints are hypermobile, and um, in the joints that are affected, particularly my upper extremity, um, things like turning a door handle can be quite painful. So I thought that um, since that was painful, but my lower extremities were stronger and tended to hold up better, maybe I could open door handles with my lower extremities. Um, so to do this, this is tied on to the door handle with the dinosaur and glitter as my personal touch. On the inside, I don't know if you can see, but I did strips of hot glue because when I first put this on, it was slipping all over the place, but now as you can see, it doesn't slip very much at all. Um, down here, I just tied um, a reg. oh, and up here is also a slip knot, so it can be adjusted to um, different doorknobs, and also as I pull on it, the knot will grow tighter, um, again, making it less likely to slip. Um, down here, just a regular knot, not a slip knot. And I also put some hot glue um, on the bottom where I'm going to be putting my feet, um, partly to protect the fabric and partly for um, better traction. And luckily for me, this actually works quite well. I'm going to try and get this whole thing in the shot. So I put my foot in here and I turn it and then I'll use my other hand to push the door. And it works pretty well. So I'm quite happy. As my first assistive device I've made is functional and will definitely help me out. Thanks for watching. Bye.